say it be hurting, hit her cervix, I'm not damaging Had her on her back, I made her tap like she's a rascal She was getting cracked, and catch you back, nigga, you mad at her As soon as I crack, I sent her back like get your cabbage Please don't smoke your pack, that shit is whack, it smell like ass in here If you want legit, holla ass shit, she got that bag in here If you get a whiff and get a sniff, it smell like gas in there If you want a zip, come Follow me, Leah, quite a boy that is coming your way, now, it was a lot of familiar members telling me that they really enjoyed the first quarter so avoided. So I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and bring y'all a part two. But this time we about to do the female rapper edition. Now the females that you about to see, they do a lot of spitting, but will they have the opportunity to do a lot of sitting on this fat and lengthy and girthy kids kids off? Let's find out. Now the first MC that you about to see that's about to appear on my screen, Molly Brazy. Hmm. Now Molly Brazy is from Detroit, Michigan. My town, also known as D-Town, and she definitely can get this zig down. You know what I'm saying? Um, now, Molly Brazy is a pure example of deception. In her lyrics, she often talk about killing, she often talk about drilling, she often talk about the Draco. But what she really wants is to be Picasso. You know what I'm saying? You put this fat back dog in her, she go, she go shake, she can't take it. Um, she's nice and petite, that's cool, because I like a skinny girl anyway, because they get to maneuver easily on this kid. If you got a girl that got a lot of meat and thick that usually slows her down. Now Molly Brady has a nice little face for paint, painting and decorating. Make a Pablo Picasso mural out of her face. Lean out of the dig a dick her face. Leave my mark on her face. Leave my kids on her face. That is definitely coy. She's definitely getting smashed. But let me tell you something, Molly. Um, just because you got that bag, you're not about to manipulate me. Let me tell you what I mean by this. A lot of people that's rich and got that bag, they usually can manipulate a regular person. You see what I'm saying? Let's say if you got a famous rapper that's in your town, you know what I'm saying? They make a post like, hey, I need all the baddies to come to my hotel and give me some head. Ten times out of ten, some baddies are going to come and give them some head just because they, they got the bag. They got the recognition. They have the ability to do so. And it's not just with dudes. Females can do that too because females out here getting that bag too. So she's not about to manipulate me. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if you got a bag or not. You going to give me some head. Head. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if I'm with Rihanna. She still has the same expectations as that hood rat in my neighborhood named Tatiana. You gonna give me some head. I'ma pull this Kong dong out, Molly. I'ma sla slap it against your juicy lips. You know what I'm saying? Tell you to let me in. After that, you know what I'm saying? I'm slowly gonna gl glide this fat Kezak in your mouth. And then them soft, succulent, juicy lips is just gonna hug around my Kezak. And I'ma gag gag it. Before I go anywhere near that Versace belt, you're going to give me some head, swallow my kids until you belt belch. That's when I yanked that Versace belt off from the last hole. Because I know that Versace belt is in the last hole because you're very skinny and that's cool. You know, and then that's when I shove two, two inches of shaft in. Yank it out, four inches of shaft in. Yank it out, six, six inches of shaft in you. Yank it out, go back up to five because I see you crying. I know that it hurt. Then I'm like, you know what, you a big girl, you should be used to this kid's eye. Next thing you know, sweet home Alabama, bam diddly yam with a whole eight inches is in you, shorty. So that is definitely snatch. The next MC that we about to see, Lil' Kim. Ew, shorty, why your fake face like this? You need to go see a doctor, shorty, that's not healthy. Now don't get me wrong, back in the day when Biggie was smashing her, she look good, but now she looks like a complete disaster. You look horrible, shorty. You know what I'm saying? You need to go see a doc doctor ASAP. Um, I don't think that's healthy. So that's definitely avoided. Come back to me when you was riding Biggie. That's how you need to be. That's how you need to look. But now you look like the bottom of a foot. Next MC that we about to see. Cash Dow with that ass out. Now Cash Dow is from Detroit, Michigan as well. And she definitely can get this big down. Mm. Look at her nice little ch chocolate milky skin. Mm. She probably fresh out the shower. She probably smell like some floral too. Mm. Skin nice and silky like my do rag. Now that is definitely smash. Oh, I wanna give it to Cash. Now look at her in this picture. Let me describe the scenario, what's going on, because a lot of y'all may be confused. Um, I actually sent a picture of my kid Kizok to Cash Dial. You know what I'm saying? And she's looking like, damn, that's too much girth, that's too much length. I don't know how it's gonna fit. So that's how she looking. But we go find a way, Shorty. We definitely go find a way. 
I'm gonna stretch you out like a yoga instructor. I'm gonna plop, plop you real good. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna lift your right leg up in the air and I'm gonna pop pound you out so hard. If I would have saw you in that position, I would have slid up on you just like this. Okay, what you doing? You looking at the phone? Put the phone down. Put the phone down. Lift your right leg up in the air. I'm coming. And I would have bust, bust in you. I would have bust in you. Because I want you to have my baby. Last and final girl that we got up on this list. Nicki Minaj. Mm. And I like this picture. I like this picture. I definitely would smash her. I would smash her so hard. From the back, back until she tapped. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, I kind of contradicted myself. But I'm kind of thinking with my dizzy right now. I just said that I really don't prefer thick girls, but you know what I'm saying? In this case with Nicki Minaj, I would definitely smash that. You know what I'm saying? I would want her to sit down on this kid's kid like real slow. You know what I'm saying? She might jump up a little bit because it's too much girth. It's too much damn girth in you now. You know what I'm saying? You feel that long st stick in you. You know what I'm saying? She sit down real slow. She like, oh, 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 oh. And I'm like, come on down. Come on down. Come on down to them nuts. Nah, nah. She like, but I can't. She goes too big. Too much meat at me. I'm like, damn, shorty. Like, she probably knew that I was going to see this picture, but she probably wanted to piss me off on purpose because, like, when I'm pissed off, I go full force in the girl, and she probably want that kitty wrecked from the back. back. All right, y'all, that is the end of this court. It's so avoided. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, like it, comment, share, subscribe. Ah, better. God.